Oh, good thing you said something. I forgot to plug the HDMI cable in so Kathy's monitor worked. I'll pull you around here. Spidey's out there hanging off over the edge of a 300 foot cliff. And there you can see us. I don't think we'll go up any higher with him, but we'll back up some here and show you kind of where we are. We're up on the top of the ridge west of the Bethel Tower out on the Cache Prairie Ironstone Mountain Road. And we came up here to fly this kind of a interesting looking basin thing that we saw from down below. I'll pull you down here so you can see it. As you're looking on the screen here from Spidey's point of view, we can't fly out to the left of where he is because, well, we can over to the edge of the ridge there, but it's wilderness area beyond that. So we're gonna kind of stay back over here and all we really want to see is this basin anyway. Trying something today, we're flying without the explore mode so we don't have the infinite zoom all the time we're on single camera and if we want something different we have to switch but it gets us 5.1k on this 24 millimeter camera so we're shooting at 5.1k and if i go to the 70 and the 166 it'll only be at 4k but all of it is 50 frames per second. I'll swing back over here and you can look over towards Bethel. there is the tower we'll do a 360 here and get some pictures down around highway 12 and the other side it's kind of windy up here but Spidey's doing good he's staying stable actually at the upper edge of cool it's almost cold up here in fact with the wind blowing it is cold my co-pilot is sitting over here all bundled up with coat jacket and a blanket and I all I've got so long sleeve shirt there you can see goose egg and back up here this ridge starts popping up in front of us that's off to the right of where we're sitting and that's a wilderness area we can't fly over there we can only fly to the edge of this open bowl
there you can see up there on the left end of that open ridge we're sitting about 15 feet back from a straight drop off and that was as close as I could get my co-pilot to it <laughs> and this took a little bit of persuading You can see this kind of a bare little bowl up here. I think we're a little about five or six tenths of a mile out the Cache Prairie Ironstone Road. And then there's a little two track goes out to an old campsite right here on the edge of this what amounts to a cliff. This isn't going to be a big area to fly, but we saw it from way down below. And we kind of wanted to come up here and take a look. This won't be a real long flight in this bowl. It was just an exploratory thing to come in and see what it kind of looked like. My co-pilot is being kind of quiet. I just can hear her knees knocking together and her teeth chattering over there. Because where we're sitting, it's an open window right out into the wind, and it's, it's a little nippy. see where we're sitting there I'll gain some altitude here Over there you can see the landing pad. A 
And there you can see the two Shiver and Seniors down there. I'll get centered up a little bit here. I can zoom in with this 24 millimeter. Yep, I see a blanket. Yeah, the beer cans on ours. People up here can't seem to figure out how to take their trash home with them. I'm gonna get over here. You can see we're right over the landing pad. We're at 200 feet now. We can go up to 400, so I'm gonna go up to 400. First, I'll get the camera leveled back out, and then we'll go up to 400 and do a 360, which puts us up probably about as high as the top of Bethel over where the tower is. We're still at 50 degrees tilted down, so the drone's not actually flying right now. The movement you see is caused by me raising the, the gimbal up to get it back up level and get some perspective back and do a 360. There you can see where we turned off of that road that got us back in here. We're still 20 degrees down on the gimbal. You can sure see where the fire went through. Okay. Now let's go up. We'll see what Spidey does with the wind up there. I won't go all the way to 400. We're about 390. I'll pull it down just a hair. That's looking over into that back country north of where we are that we saw the big country back in behind Timberwolf. Now we'll rotate to the right. Yeah, we're 380 feet up. Still got 60% battery and full signal. Distance wise from where we're sitting straight up, the drone's only 37 feet away from us now, horizontally, but he's 388 to 390 feet vertically. Lots of big clouds up here today. Lots of movement. I think that's Timberwolf over there coming up in the center. Yeah. I'll get you can see that I, if you watched the last video when we were up at Timberwolf, we came down and flew in a meadow. And that's it. Dead center over there. I'll go back out. I had zoomed in some and I wasn't keeping track of it. I will swing on around.
Now you're looking dead center of the screen is the west end of Bethel. If you look close over there, you can see the tower. See the road going up there, but that road is closed because of fire, potential fire hazard. I don't think Spidey's having any trouble keeping his battery and motors cool up where he is. We're gonna fly this whole flight here with just the 24 millimeter, some cropping in, but We'll see what it looks like at 5.1K. Looks like rim rock over there. There you can see that road where we're kind of in the lower center of the screen. See a vehicle going out that road. We can fly over here if we stay right above this road. You should see that vehicle come back out into sight up there pretty soon if they haven't stopped. There it is. Top of the screen. They're trucking right along. And we we'll stay up here where we can, but we can Look at the extension of this bowl we looked at. It kind of goes out to a ridge out in the middle and then it curls around into this one over here that we're looking at now. But on the ridge between the two out here is as far as we can go to the west. Right now we're still above the road, but we're just pivoting back around to the left. Now you can see that ridge that goes down and is the border of the wilderness area. Down there you can see the truck. I'll pull it up here and we'll take one last look at Bethel. We'd like to go over there to Bethel. I want to fly up where the tower is because with the 107 that I have, 
If we're within 400 feet of that tower, I can fly to 400 feet above the top of the tower. So as long as we stay within 400 feet of that tower, we can go to 687 feet up, but not today. There you can see the truck and the trees. See if I can get a side view of this little cliff we're sitting on there. Camera kind of flattens things out. It doesn't look as steep as it really is. But trust me, my steepness indicator over here let, huddled up in this blanket tells me it's straight down about 15 feet out in front of us. There you can see both of us. Okay. 
bring my little buddy home. He's probably shivering up there. If we're shivering down here, you can see him. Well, you can't see him. We can see him. He's right here in front of us. Get over, little buddy. Touchdown. All right, everybody run for the truck and turn the heater on.